So this is hex node. Here is your enrolled devices. So if you tap this button there, all those as a dashboard, that 352 is the enrolled devices. That's gonna give you everything that we have currently. You can search here or here. Um, let's say for in Phoenix, you'll see I got West Dunlap there and it shows me the group there. I can tap it and it'll go right to the device. Let me do mine so you see exactly what to expect. Uh, Debo, okay, QA Debo. Okay, so you'll see under, here's the beta QA, engineering, when's the last time it checked in? It needs to be in the last five minutes. Um, let's say policies. You'll see under default teller policy, that is what we want to see, uh, and that's what we're gonna do next here. Um, if it has not checked in, what you can do is hit scan device. So when you hit scan device, it says action executed, or ex action execution initiated. If you go to action history, it's going to show you all the things it's been trying to do. So it is pending trying to scan the device. That is the last time it checked in. That's what that reference is. What you're checking here is basically, can it talk to us? Is it able to make the connection where it may get your app update or whatever you're trying to do? So we're gonna go back to policies so that we can get this update done. Default teller policy is there. Let's hit the trash can that you saw there, spinning, spinning, action initiated successfully. So now what I'm gonna do is go associate policy, choose default teller policy, hit associate, and now it should populate again. And now what I wanna do to make sure that it's done, you can talk to the person on the phone obviously and hear from them that it has happened. They'll see that it, everything changes and then goes back to the way they expected it to be. But right now it's only showing it removed the policy and it removed applications and you'll see success. So refresh, refresh. You're noticing, you may notice here it says remove applications failed. There were no applications on there, that's why. I didn't give it enough time to do that. So now that I did um, action history and I did refresh, you'll see that it's associating the policy that is in progress and it has set the wallpaper. So that is, it's in, it's in progress. There's nothing more you can do. It should have happened on their side. If it, they don't get the application in the next two minutes, uh, what that means is like it's going to show up on their iPad and spin uh, and install and be accessible for them to click. Um, you do this process over again, which would be policies, remove via the trash can and associate via default teller policy. Um, and that is it. Thank you.